I'm going to My Lists now. And My Lists is a feature that was new in September 20, 2021. And this is a way of creating your own lesson modules. So I'm going to create a new lesson and I'm going to say Intro to Music Play Online. And now I can go around the site and I can add things to my list. So I liked the Ikebaka song. So I'm going to go back to it. And I'm going to add the, uh, I'm going to add the notation concept slide. Because I'll start with the students reading the rhythm and then reading the solfa. So I'm going to add it to Intro to Music Play Online. And I'm going to say it's Ikebaka Notation. I added it to my list. I don't want it on that one. I just want to add it to one list. There we go. Intro to Music Play Online. It's added and I can go out of this. If I want to add the beat and rhythm activities, add to my list. There it goes. And I'll say in here beat and rhythm. At this time it won't go to a specific number. It'll just go to the main menu and you can click on the number. And this clicks me out of there. I can add to the list anything that's on the website. So as we go through the website today, I'll continue to add things to it. If I want to, I can copy that and make it my own and customize it. So I clicked copy to my list. First thing I'm going to do is edit the title. And I'm going to leave grade two. And I'm going to say it's January week three, and I'm going to save it. And if I decide, okay, I don't want to use the video for Echo Domi So, I'm going to just do that myself. I can trash it. If I want to uh, leave the mouse mousey in, I can do that. But if I decide I want the Solfa Challenge first, I can move it higher and lower. In any of the lists, if I want to add a link to an external site, I can do that at the very bottom. I'm going to go to my other list that I started, our Intro to Music Play Online, because it's shorter, and I'm going to add a procedure. This is at the bottom of every lesson. And so now I'm going to go to YouTube and I'm going to add, let's see, let's learn about mice because we had mouse mousey. So we have fascinating facts about mice that we need to know. Not quite sure why I would want that, but I am going to learn some fascinating facts about mice. I put the link in there and I'm going to call it Mice Facts. I can add teaching notes if I want. I add the procedure and it is now part of my lesson. If it's at the bottom of my lesson and I want it at the top, I just have to press the down arrow. And now Mice Facts starts off my lesson. So I can add external links to these. I can edit. I can change. I can copy the learning modules and make them my own. 